hi welcome now i am going to show you how to solve a polynomial of nth degree okay what i have here is the uh, constants kn1 kn kn minus 1 and so on similarly i have uh, for uh, x power n okay so kn into x power n plus kn minus 1 x power n minus 1 plus and so on okay 2k1 into x power 1 which is uh, x okay k1 x plus uh, constant okay all this equal to 0 okay this equation I am trying to solve it uh, using Excel okay so in the Excel we have uh, data what if analysis which is a forecast group okay it is a forecasting analysis okay now what we have here is called gold seek okay what if go analysis gold seek what is gold seek you find the right input for the value you want so the value you want is the outcome we have outcome we want the f input for that outcome okay so usually in function we send the input we get the outcome or the return value of the function now here what we are doing is the reverse okay we already set the outcome okay this outcome needs to be uh, zero for in this case the outcome of this polynomial uh, equation the the whole thing needs to be zero so i set it for zero then i will try to solve for x that means i want the input for what input this equation will become zero for that i will keep putting a uh, different values for x and find out whether it is converging to zero okay for a particular x okay that is here in the gold seek okay so what i am going to do is i have a equation here so for this case i i took uh, the n is 7 okay so, so this seventh degree equation okay so you can take it for any any degree but it will take time for when you increase the power okay so i take it for x power 7 okay and uh, this equation the answer is 3 okay so how i am going to solve this okay so now i'll i'll go here i have a x here which is my x is the cell b5 okay so for b5 uh, is my x so i'm going to write the formula okay so equal to b5 power 7 which is carrot 7 which is in the numeric letter 6 okay shift uh, 6 okay 7 minus 2 into x power which is b power 6 carrot 6 minus x power 5 which is nothing but b power b power 5 okay plus 2 into x power 4 2 into x power 4 which is b power b 5 b5 power 4 plus 3 into b5 power b5 power 3 into b5 power 3 which is b5 cube Okay, then minus 2 into x square which is b5 square b5 square 
p phi square then minus x which is nothing but minus b phi minus b phi minus 708 all right i'll put a 3 is it 0 yes okay okay now this is uh, it's showing minus 708 because the x value is 0 now currently okay we are going to solve this uh, uh, formula for the cell b5 okay b5 is x here usually you put a value here for any cell then you write a formula to calculate and take the return value of the formula formula cell in this case is the reverse the return value we are going to set this uh, return value cell to zero for changing different x for example here well, how we can solve it by okay i will put it one okay it is minus 708 i put it two okay and uh, three and keep putting i will find a uh, zero so changing value of x i will find the value of the equation the formula okay so in this case i put a zero what is one it's not changing at all okay surprisingly one is also sound at eight okay anyway zero okay now wh what we are going to do is we are going to solve this formula using the goal seek okay how to solve it go oh, what if goal seek okay i put it here now the value what you want to set for fi fi is the whole polynomial okay equation is there i want it set to zero by changing values in x okay change keep changing this value to achieve f i to zero okay set a cell f i f i is nothing but the whole formula which is the polynomial of nth degree equation okay keep uh, keep uh, this value i want this value to be zero by changing the cell you just change this x to find out which value will, will satisfy my f i to zero okay press ok see it is doing the iterations uh, to find out the value okay now what happens here is that we have a number here and the iteration stopped okay our target value is zero but it is obviously not zero okay so what happened it achieved the maximum number of uh, iterations uh, or the searching so what we need to do is that uh, we run it one more time okay to find uh, if this value is you see this value is satisfying the lhs which is uh, our descent value is zero for this x then you can stop the iteration but in this case it is not so i'm going to run it one more time okay this value f i is zero changing values x is b5 obviously this is also not zero so i want to run it one more time okay because they already fixed the number of iterations here inside the goal seek you may not uh, run it in one shot okay you can see the x which you received is satisfying the equation if it is not satisfying you run it one more time for that uh, the initial value of x helps uh, for example you know this equation approximately it will it will converge or give the solution within a range then you can give that range then it will work very fast okay in uh, in our case i put zero but it is going the third equation third iteration third time i am doing this okay by changing this okay this is uh, minus 22000 but e is plus 30 so it is a big number so minus so i'm doing one more time okay if you have uh, uh, 
quadratic equations or uh, linear equations or uh, cubic equations is very fast but uh, when the power is going high then it may need you may need to do it few times uh, okay okay now it is almost coming closer 3.06 is giving you the LHS is converging to a zero but it is not exactly zero still 133 is there so what we are doing is we are doing one more time okay fi is zero but uh, I am changing the variable x now you can see it is uh, already 3.000 which is converging to 0 0.000 and so on okay so you can you can uh, use this as a result or you can check one more time to see whether it is improving the result okay it is not improving the result it says that uh, it uh, target value is zero and the current value is this it is not so what you can do is you can remove the the, the very decimal parts and uh, work with it it automatically comes with zero okay so this way you can uh, start uh, solving your polynomial equations uh, and uh, get the answer in excel okay for this i used uh, what if analysis and goal seek okay i'm not using any formula here i just uh, 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 if i if i'm not wrong there is no general formula for solving uh, polynomial of nth degree for uh, any n there is no general formula like uh, quadratic equation we have minus p plus or minus root uh, b square minus 4 ac by 2a and uh, also for cubic also we have a formula but uh, if i'm not wrong i read uh, there is one uh, theorem it says that there is no general formula to solve uh, uh, all the polynomial of uh, any n uh, right i'm I, i'm not very sure okay but uh, is there is no general formula so you can use this method to solve it okay and um, you uh, if you like my videos uh, please uh, subscribe to my channel it is already there in your uh, video screen to please uh, press and uh, subscribe to it and also leave your comments and suggestions in the comments box it will be very helpful to me and uh, god bless you